The world is convinced carbon dioxide causes dangerous global warming, yet there is not one repeatable experiment that exists to support the claim. Up to 2003, the world had been shown the following graph. It showed carbon dioxide levels and the Earth's temperature from ice core drilling at Vostok. Everyone could see the correlation, and because we know carbon dioxide is a greenhouse gas, we assumed the carbon dioxide could push temperatures very high. This was the first wrong assumption. Since 2003, the data has been studied more precisely and it is conclusive that the temperature rose before the carbon dioxide levels did. This is the complete opposite to what Al Gore and Green Groups want us to believe. Next is the study of the Earth's atmosphere. If the greenhouse effect is to blame for global warming, then this is the expected temperatures we should find in the atmosphere. It is a greenhouse signature. With satellite data and weather balloon data, we now have found this is the actual graph of the atmospheric temperatures. Obviously, no correlation. The third bit of evidence that is conclusive is the lack of a relationship between the Earth's temperature to the rising carbon dioxide concentration in the atmosphere. These records are since 1980 when satellites first started measuring the temperature. Here is the Earth's average temperature during that time. Here are the carbon dioxide levels. And most interesting is that since 1998 the rise in temperature has stopped. In all three analyses it is conclusive carbon dioxide is not associated with dangerous global warming.